Hello everyone, welcome back. In today's video, we are going to learn how to customize your world, how to import assets, how to download assets. Just go ahead and go to Inspector, New to Unity, Newbie, click here and let's get you sorted. Click on Generate Rewards and voila, look at this. You have a full world. You can just customize whatever you want. You can remove objects, you can add objects, you can do whatever you want. I'm just kidding. This is a world that I've been working on, but we are going to be working on the basic template that we created earlier, which is this one. Boring, I know. But anyway, so there's two ways to import assets. First, from the Hyrax catalog, and then from the Asset Store. Let's start with the Asset Store. If you go to Window, Asset Store, this will navigate you to a new page. And here, if you don't have an account, please create an account and log in. Once you do that, you can go to Search Asset, or you can just go to 3D and search for the asset that you want. For now, I'm going to go to Assets. I'm going to type Skybox. I'm going to hit Enter. And here, you can find different assets that you can purchase or download for free. If you want free assets, go to Sort By, click, click Popularity, and then choose price from low to high. You can see here there's a bunch of skybox that you can install. I'm going to talk about the skybox in a second, but you can go ahead and install whatever you want. For now, I'm just going to go with style and I'm going to install the free styles skybox. So if you click on it and you do add to my assets, accept the terms, and then open in Unity, open in Unity editor, and there you go. It's now importing it. So wait for it to fetch all the assets. And here it is, free styles skybox. Hit download wait 10 years and then click import and here there's a bunch of different stuff that you can use which is the scene.unity if you want to load the demo scene if you want to read me for now it's okay i'm just gonna import everything and there you go you can now close this page and we have the freestyle skybox here we will learn how to use it in a second but what if i tell you there's an easier way to just drag and drop because if you're lazy i'm lazy anyway we go to high res and then we go to lua i mean studio and then the asset catalog and here you'll find a bunch of different assets that are uploaded by high rise artists so if you scroll down you're gonna find a lot of assets that you might like so here i'm gonna choose the barrel click on download wait for it to finish drag and drop into your scene simple and easy just like that if you download more, for example, let's download, let's install the, the, what do you want to install? Let's install the, the blue candle, for example, just like that. And drag and drop, get this, and the log. So let's ignore the log. We don't like logs anyway. We're going to install the, b whatever this is, the bush host whatever that is anyway so that we that there we go we have three three different assets now and you can see them here in the downloads folder now if you can't access the assets if you open if you click the three buttons right here the three points right here and you do two columns layout and here you can see that you can open the um the the assets that you just downloaded each asset has a as a material and some assets has scripts and other has uh elements and children Anyway, that was the easiest way to do it. Just so you know, the asset catalog is limited. We don't have much assets yet. You can always find free assets on the assets in the Unity store. I'm going to teach you how to use the assets that you install from Unity store. All right, so that is done. We don't want the ugly thing panel right here. So let's just get rid of that. Now we also don't want the visual virtual player. So I'm going to right click and close the tab. Now I also don't want to look at the game view, but I'm looking right now. This is a white page. I don't like this. It's so ugly. Do you like it? I mean, if you like it, you can keep it, but I'm going to change it. Remember we installed an asset in the skybox from the asset store so let's use it let's minimize the downloads let's expand the freestyle style skybox and let's look at the cube map and the materials and the textures so for example if you want to change the skybox which is the sky around the scene you simply go to lighting environment and you locate skybox material right now if you click on this one on the sky it, you'll see here it will take you to the default sky that's provided by high rise so if you click on that and if you go to inspector here you can see the skybox you can change the inside and you can change the outside this is just just a gradient but we're not going to use it we're going to use our own so we go to lighting again environment and then you click on this little thing right here and here you can see we have a bunch of different skybox that we can use now you will not have the same skybox if you didn't install the asset that we installed earlier so if you install more than one asset you're going to see more than one skybox right here so let's go ahead and choose one of them so i'm going to go with this one i like this one well you look at that So that's it for today. I mean, we covered how to import assets in two different ways, from the catalog and from the asset store. I've been talking fast through the video. I know, you can pause, you can slow the down the video, but I mean, who doesn't know how to import assets? Just go to Google, type assets, 3D assets, download, there you go, easy and done. Now, we are gonna learn more about Hi-Rai Studio and Unity in the later episodes. We're gonna write scripts together and we're gonna make games together. Stay tuned for more videos. Thank you so much for watching.